Let's take a look at our rake or wait forecast. Today, you're going to be able to rake. A little bit chilly right now, and there still even could be a touch of snow in some of the highest elevations from the other day, but for most, that's gone. So we're pretty good here, not a lot of wind. Tomorrow, I'm saying wait, it's chilly. We could see some new accumulation overnight and early tomorrow. A little iffy on Tuesday, spotty sprinkle or a flurry, but it's not going to be a lot, but still temperatures a little on the cool, chilly side to be working outside. This is not reaching the ground up to the north. This is uh, what's falling from the sky and evaporating. Here's fossil service experts live triple Doppler radar showing up as some flurries there and sprinkles over the lake. We are dry dealing with some cloud cover, especially north and west of the city, more in the way of sunny breaks south and east. Here's our next weather maker. This low pressure system will give us a quick shot at some snow during the overnight tonight by the morning commute tomorrow. So here's what you need to know today. Today, dry and slightly warmer. We do make the lower 40s. Not a lot of wind, so the wind chill is not a factor today. Accumulating light snow develops. This evening, we're dry. It's going to be after midnight, a slushy trace to an inch, perhaps more in some spots. And then the snow ends early tomorrow. We're back to chilly temperatures in the upper 30s for highs. So here's the future cast starting today at noon. A mix of sun and clouds then. The clouds actually break up some before they increase late day. And then during the evening, <clears throat> Some rain and snow on the light side moving into the Finger Lakes towards 10, 11 o'clock around midnight and 1 a.m. in central New York. And really, it is off and on. It is light, and that's why I'm thinking an inch or less, mostly on colder surfaces, but it could be enough with temperatures dropping into the 20s for some slick spots for the Monday morning commute. Those snow showers taper off, move away. We get a lot of clouds tomorrow and that chilly weather, maybe an odd sprinkle or flurry. Here's what Futurecast is putting out for snowfall. A trace to an inch throughout the area in some of these higher elevations, the Mohawk River Valley, maybe the Adirondacks, the Tug Hill, and south southeast of Syracuse could get a slushy inch or two on colder surfaces especially. So partly sunny, pleasant midday and afternoon. Enjoy 42 our high tonight. Periods of light snow develops up to an inch for most of us down to 26 for our low snow showers early taper to spotty sprinkle or flurry. We're back into the 30s. We should be at 50 nor near that for the next couple of days. Spotty sprinkle or flurry on Tuesday 41. My pick day is near 50 degrees. That's the best we do 48 here on Wednesday with partial sunshine showers in the morning. Thursday becomes scattered 47 dry weather returns for Friday and a stronger system next weekend drops our temperature. It was nice to have no frost on the car this morning, and it was surprising. Tomorrow could be a little snow on the windshield. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Mike. Still to come this morning on Weekend Today 